All right, September hike back on the trail after almost two months, right? We took the August off yeah, for the, like that. Had to move. the rock hopper move. So wheels just dropped us off. We got 9.3 today, Friday. Feels great to be back out here. We need to go off the grid, kind of reset our minds, nature. So definitely thankful to be out here. Looking forward to an awesome weekend. Eleven thirty Friday morning. It's our first uh, view of the weekend. It's called Winter Green View. Uh, appears to be a ski lodge, ski slope area. Not sure if that's the name of the ski resort or not. But I would suspect that is the case. I'm renaming it Rock Hopper Lodge. Rock Copper Lodge, he says. Yeah. <laughs> Beautiful day. Don't you love when they put the white blazes on rocks? I feel like I'm in Pennsylvania. Good bit of a climb starting out today. Nice view. Going through a little ski slope area over there. Gotta get up there. It's not too hard. Well, here's some nice rock view. After the rains, we think this is Ivy Creek. And after the rains, this is pretty swollen. It's not too bad. But Mike's, I'm sorry, Noki is gonna have to pull a rock hopper here. Come on, rock hopper. Oh no, wait, that's me. I'll just hold still until I get him going across. And now it'll be my turn. See on the other side if I don't drown. All right, I just went across. Rock Hopper is uh, working his way over. Nice job. All right, just across the creek. Uh, this will be our home for the night. Uh, so we got quite a few tenning spots over here. Uh, up there is the shelter, Paul Wolf shelter. It's pretty nice. Okay, uh, fire pit area over there as well. Well, we, uh, we just went down to get some 
water and uh, we got some water. yeah, <laughs> we got some water. The skies opened up, so we made a good choice to uh, pick the shelter for tonight. That's for sure. Tomorrow and Sunday look pretty good, though. I think this is going to be a shower last a little about an hour or so. All right, Saturday morning. Nice uh, stay at the Paul Wolf shelter last night. Certainly a good choice considering the big downpour we had. Next few days look pretty dry. Uh, today we have 12.7 to the Calf Mountain shelter. A few uh, streams and springs along the way and then for the first few miles and then it's a little dry for the last six so we'll probably cam up on the last uh, stream there there is uh, water right before the shelter ah. why well, did you step in last time Certainly the rain last night has uh, helped with the water flow today. Well, look what we found. It's a little tractor farm. This is where they grow tractors. You can kind of see the seats just poking up out of the ground. Yeah, this one's almost ready to be harvested. up here on top of the mountain here uh, a lot of big uh, microwave towers have you reached the top of a little cat mountain like a big meadow up here overlooking so we just need to go up to calf mountain and then down over the other side and all right good morning rock hopper it's uh, morning. Sunday we got uh, 13 today into Black Rock Hut. Last night's stay, we uh, ended up in tents. Um, one of the lucky ones to get a tent spot, not much room there. A lot of people at the camp last night. Don't forget Sneaky Pete. Sneaky Pete was there. Hannah, a firefighter, was there. So we're uh, looking for another good day. Um, looks to be dry heading down the mountain right now so a little tough on the knees nice peaceful hike coming down uh, the other side of the mountain not too steep Quite a few ups and downs today on the way to Black Rock Mountain in the hut. Well, there's a baby copperhead going right across the trail. Don't want to get near him. Up there, rock hopper. <laughs> right in my seesaw. Here comes rock hopper. We made it. 13.4. Black Rock Hut is right around the corner here. And that'll be our home for the night. Of course, they saved the toughest climb for the end of the day, right? And in the sun. And in the sun. So we're going to go down and find a tent spot, hopefully, and get these packs off. That's no, Monday morning. This is um, Black Rock Hut. There's probably about uh, seven or eight people here last night. We stayed up there on the hill. 
getting everything packed up here and getting ready to head back on the trail. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, everybody. Guess what day today is? Town day! <laughs> ah well, yeah, we get to see wheels today in the wayside, and this is the last day. Uh -huh. Getting some breakfast. Look at that. Look That's at that. enough calories to get me all the way there. I'm going uh, green belly. Green so, belly and a kind of bar. Yep, we got 11.3 <laughs> today. Uh, eight, well, almost eight to the campground. We're going to stop yeah. there, maybe get some uh, lunch or ice cream. I thought it was 11.6. You're shortening the day on me, huh? That's cool. I like that. I think it is. 11.3, 11.6. Hey, what's, <laughs> what's 0.3 miles? <laughs> it's a hike down to the uh, hut. That's what That's it right. is. That's right. Yep. We're at the uh, Black Rock Mountain Summit. Beautiful view. There's a couple guys that stayed with us last night. They came up here this morning for sunrise early. I heard them packing, packing up around five. Another beautiful view. Makes the climb worthwhile. Here's the view approaching Loft Mountain. In less than a mile or so, there's a mountain store that we're gonna stop at, grab some lunch. It's not a restaurant. Probably ham and cheese sandwiches, but ham and cheese is better than the slop that they serve us out here on the trail. Noki's probably already there munching down and just a couple feet in from where I was just videoing there's a good little deer I turn my head and there goes another one hello hi hi Hop around the corner. I think there's nothing to see. And this is what we get. And here comes Noki. Gonna cross the old Rivey Creek. There's plenty of dry rocks. <clears throat> plenty of dry rocks to step on. Hey, we stopped uh, here at Ivy Creek. This is the start of the final climb of the weekend. To get sea wheels. Some rock carpers over there waiting for me. Beautiful views. Wrapping up the day, heading down the mountain. Beautiful deer right here, right? Probably 10 feet from me. Startled me coming around the corner. He's just saying hi. All right, we're complete with the Shenandoah National Park. We are done. Yep, 46.6 uh, miles. This weekend, altogether, hundred and something. Yeah, what is the Shenandoah National Park? It's over a hundred. I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> we had pretty good weather. Um, we had the thunderstorm Friday night, but fortunately, we made it to the shelter in time. Came down hard for twenty minutes, but yep. we were indoors. Yep, beautiful weekend. Otherwise, yep. um, thankful to be out here and uh, looking forward to next month when we break. The 25% mark. And we were waiting for no dial tone to pick us <laughs> dial up. Dial tone. Wheels, where's your phone? <laughs>